Now to a controversy surrounding Douglas County's new deputy 911 director. Yeah, last month, the county hired former Omaha Deputy Chief of Police Greg Gonzalez. Well, the sheriff is voicing concern and 911 officials are responding. KETV Newswatch 7's Alex McLoon is live in West Omaha. Yeah, Rob, Julie, an attorney for Grant Gonzalez calling this retaliation after Gonzalez's wife won about a million dollars in a lawsuit against the city and police department, then filed a second suit earlier this year. Tonight, though, Metro 911 officials were scheduled to meet for the first time since Gonzalez was hired earlier this year, but were not able to because of the city of Omaha officials who skipped out in protest. Tonight, though, an attorney for Gonzalez, Tom White, says he hopes Gonzalez will serve as deputy director. And if not, quote, we have given ourselves over to brutal character assassination and retaliation politics and at an enormous expense to the taxpayers. Tonight, Douglas County says it hired deputy directors in 2010 and 2017 without input or complaints from Metro's 911 users board. Douglas County says Gonzalez was the best candidate among three final because of his 25 years at the Omaha Police Department and because he agreed to start at $119,000 while the second place candidate asked for $145,000. Former political opponent for Sheriff Aaron Hansen is pushing an inspection into the selection process saying it's not about personal reasons but that deputies are deeply screened. We will actually reach out to law enforcement agencies that may be familiar with the individuals. And there's been no, no concerns expressed to us from the users group during those two previous hires. That's the county administrative officer who says it's only required to seek input from Metro 911 officials when selecting a director, something Sheriff Hansen says Gonzalez is next in line for. Meanwhile, the sheriff also shared concerns about potential access to sensitive information from 911 calls, something that the county denies Gonzalez having access to. This interlocal agreement between Douglas County and Omaha is about financial efficiency. The county says it's not aware about any potential threats to response times. Live in Douglas County, Alex McLoon, KETV News Watch 7.